Being inducted in the FDU Hall of Fame is a dream come true. When you think about you know, the journey and you know, where you started. And one of my favorite moments in my career probably is when I first started and um, I was working on a project. Uh, and um, here I am, this young kid who didn't know much about technology, much about implementing big systems. And it was a success. Uh, and it really did catapult my career. He worked hard, I mean really hard when we were young. The three banks, Chemical Bank, Manufacture Hanover, and Chase Manhattan Bank were the first three banks to have that debit card interchangeable. My husband got chosen to be on that project. That's when his career took off when he did that. People don't know this, but on Wells Fargo, he was the first African-American man to be on the operating committee. So he strived to get that far. Lester is an incredible leader. Um, he's one of the most respected members of the operating committee, but he leaves a much broader impact uh, across the company because of what he does to reach out to people and his constant desire to help. His family is his biggest support and his grandmother, always told him, Les, you can be anything, you can do anything. And no matter what the strive was, he was motivated to do better. He always wanted to do better. My grandmother is the one who inspired me early on in my career. Her caring about people, uh, caring about me, and she's just she was a great human being. And you know, she's uh, with the great Lord and um, I miss her tremendously. What really motivates me is my family. I thank my wife, I thank my four kids, because it's really about what they've done for me. One thing that I admire the most about my dad is, is very simply his work ethic. I always say that he's got this extra gear, right, that he can always find. And, and once you think he hit one gear, right, he, he finds another one. The best advice my dad ever gave me was, if you want to be the best, you got to outwork the rest. What I admire the most about my dad is his willing to give. Um, even with everything he's gotten throughout all his life. He's always given back to the community, his family. Everything he does and everything he's done for the past 40-something years, he's done it for other people. What I admire most about my dad is how he has so much love for his family. To him, family is home. It's where you show unconditional love through the good times and the bad. You look back as a husband and a father and making sure that you've done the right things as much as you possibly can. I've enjoyed every aspect of it. To my loving husband, I am so proud of you from where we come from and what we have attained together is absolutely amazing. So congratulations. Very well deserved and we are so excited to see what you do in the next chapter of your life. We love you. Thank you for the confidence you've given us and always loving us no matter what. Thank you for everything you have done for not only myself, but my three older brothers. You have always put us first. Um, we would not be anywhere where we are without you. Dad, congratulations. You, this is very well deserved. You put in the work. Now it's time for you to sit back and relax. Les, my man, congratulations on everything that you've accomplished. What I want to say to my lifelong friend, congratulations. Lester, and Barbara, congratulations on achieving the Lifetime Achievement Award. Lester, congratulations on, on behalf of our team at Wells Fargo and wish you all the best. Lester, congratulations on this Lifetime Achievement Award. Hey Lester, congratulations on receiving the Lifetime Award. Congratulations, Lester. Lester, congratulations on the Lifetime Award. Congratulations, Grandpa. We love you.